Oh. Hello. <laughs> um, okay, so my last few videos have kind of been more towards school, and I'm sorry, but this is also kind of more towards school. Um, mainly because I'm a senior this year, so it's kind of like extremely, extremely nerve wracking for me. With like a bunch of different stuff that's gonna be going on, and a bunch of stuff I have to pay for, and all this stuff that's going on this year. So I decided to kind of make a video about, I mean, my personal feelings towards senior year, and you know, like other stuff, and just basically like what I think most people are probably feeling towards their senior year, or what most people have felt towards their senior year if they've already graduated. So that's probably what this. That's mostly what this video is going to be about. So, I have lo a lot of different, like, conflicting conflicting feelings because, one, I'm so completely, completely excited for my senior because, I mean, okay, you know, we have grad night, we have prom, we have, you know, senior panorama photo, we have senior pictures, we have all this different stuff that's going on. And, you know, it's our last year in high school and it's, it's just, you know, a lot of fun stuff ha is happening this year, so I have a lot of different conflicting feelings. Like, what am I feeling? One of the feelings that I that I'm feeling <laughs> is um is that I'm extremely happy because you know it's it's last year of high school. You know, after this year I'll be gone. I won't have to deal with high school anymore. I'll, you know, basically be like, you know, kind of on my own and figuring out the world on my own for the most part and then I'm also like really sad because I'm also because I'm gonna be on my own and I'm gonna be you know leaving high school and this is my last year so you know all these different feelings are conflicting like okay happy sad and then I'm really really anxious about this year because I don't know if it's gonna turn out good I don't know if something bad's gonna happen I don't know if I'm gonna be you know get into college, if I apply to colleges or whatever, or wherever I apply to, I don't know, you know, certain things that are going to happen, so I'm extremely anxious about that, because, you know, I don't, I don't know what's going to happen this year, so it's kind of, like, really, you know, hard to, not hard, but it's, like, really difficult to deal with these different feelings, because I don't exactly know all the feelings that I'm, you know, going through, or that are going through my head, or my mind, or whatever. So... At this moment, at this specific moment in time, I am extremely conflicted because I have no idea what this year is holding for me. This year, I have a lot, a lot of stuff going on. Okay, I have, I work every morning. I work from 5:30 to 7, so I will be wake up, waking up every single morning this school year. And well, I mean, yeah, for the most part, every single morning this school year. Okay, except for, you know, like, Saturdays and Sundays, because I don't work, I don't work those days, even though I don't have school those days, so I don't work those days, so, anyway. But, um, I will be wake up, waking up at 4 o'clock every single morning this school year, okay? Unless, you know, I'm told not to, or unless I tell my boss that I don't need to, or that I can't, I will be waking up with, maybe, if I'm lucky, three to four hours, three to four hours of sleep, because it's, it's hard for me to go to sleep at night and stuff, like, like, easily, so I usually go to sleep, like, around 11.30, if I'm lucky, or, like, 12 or something, or, like, a little after 12, or between 12 and 1, so I won't be getting that much sleep this year, but, um, anyways, back to the actual topic of this video, um, <laughs> I am doing so many different things, okay, I'm, I'm in bands, it's kind of nerdy, but I'm in bands, I'm in advanced bands, um, I'm, because I'm in bands, I go, have to go to every single, not every single, you know, like, away game, but I have to go to every home game. Okay, I get, up for, I get in the games for free, which is a complete bonus, so I'm really glad about that. But, um, I'm in band, okay, so I have to go to every single football game. I'm, a, I'm doing water polo, so, I mean, I have to go to games and everything. And then I have to, after the game, I have to come back to the school and depending on, you know, the days or whatever, I have to come back to the school and play for band. So after that, you know, I have that. And then I'm taking an AP class for AP English, and I have that to do with. 
and then I have work. I, I work from 9 to 11 at night. So, but after that, I have that. I mean, I won't be working at night, you know, on like Fridays and stuff anymore because I have, I'll have games, like football games, because they start around like 7 ish or whatever, or 6 30 around there. And then they go into like 10 or something, so I won't be working at night. But, um, still, and then I have, like, I have other homework. I mean, I just got my schedule recently, and I'm taking AP English, okay? I'm taking government, well, government, econ, whatever, because one semester, I might school one semester, is government, and the other semester is econ, so I'm taking that. And then I'm taking bands, and then I'm taking, um, uh, web page design class, and then I'm taking culinary. And then I have another, I have a free block. And then when school starts, I will be ha like be a student aide for a teacher, and I'm gonna be a student aide for my OP teacher because I was gonna be a student aide for my coach, but the period that I have open, he doesn't he has a prep period then, so I won't be able to TA for him. So anyway, moving on from that, um, yeah, I have so many things going on this year, and I mean, I'm a big reader, so I kind of read a lot and. I probably will not be able to read a lot, you know, within the, like, the first quarter of the year. Because Water Polo, I, Water Polo is like, you know, eight weeks or so, I think. Eight to ten weeks, I think, whatever. Because practice, practice starts like the second week of school. Like, it's, I think it starts like that Monday after that we start school. Because I start school next Wednesday. Like, I mean, this Wednesday. So, it's kind of, you know really like soon after school starts so after that I won't have a lot of time to read like for fun unless it's on the weekend and on the weekend I'll probably be doing a bunch of homework and reading for my freaking AP English class so it's a bunch of different things that I'm going to be doing this year I'm really glad that you know I'm a senior but um one thing that sucks about being a senior this year is I mean I have friends that are younger than me you know, I have friends that are like that are juniors this year, and then I have some friends that are sophomores this year. I don't, I don't have any, I don't know anybody that's um that's gonna be a freshman this year, except for like one guy that I met like since the beginning of this week with my friends. Um, but like, what's gonna suck is you know leaving my friends behind that I that are younger than me, and then and you know the teachers that I that I'm like close to like my coach I'm really close to him he's like a he's like a second dad to me and um, it's it's gonna be really hard like leaving people behind that are younger than me and that are the same age as me because some of my friends that I know are leaving you know they're moving to different states and then one of my friends is probably gonna move to a different country you know after high school so things are definitely gonna be different and I'm just I'm not a, I'm not afraid for, you know, like, after, you know, for my after high school life, but it seems like high school is my life. Like, it's been my, it's been my life for, like, the past four years, so, you know, it's going to be extremely different to not be, not, you know, not start going to school again in August, and especially with what I, you know, with what I want to do, I want to do writing, but, um, if I can't, do that right away, then I need to, you know, start thinking about my writing and thinking about college and all that different stuff. I have to, I have to start thinking about all that now because, like, applications for colleges, you know, they start, well, first of all, I have to apply for scholarships anyways, and then I have to, you know, start turning in applications for colleges and, you know, state colleges, and I'll probably apply to a few UCs too. But, um, you know, all that stuff is, like, it's only a month long for registration for colleges. And then you have to wait, like, at least four months after that to even find out if you've gone to college. So all this different stuff is going to be going on. And I'm just, I'm excited because, you know, there's a bunch of fun stuff going on. But I'm also really, you know, like, scared, too, because, I mean, I have to make sure that I, you know, I get good grades. I pass all my classes. I you know, do all of my work, I can't fucking, I can't slack off or any of that shit, I have to do all my work, I have to read all the stuff for AP, I have to do all this different stuff, so it's gonna be, it's definitely gonna be a difficult year, but it's also probably gonna be a really, really fun year, because I only have, like, I only have two 
two actually like hard classes. I mean, they're not hard, but like, because I I know my my AP English teacher. I had him as a teacher for my gate English class freshman year. So I already know how I already know how he teaches and everything. Like it's gonna be different because you know it's AP and everything, and it's not gate because gate is like you know easy. But um, it's definitely gonna be different this year. Like it's. Oh, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be so much fun, but I'm also so scared because I don't know what what's in store for me. Like I don't know exactly what's gonna happen. I have no idea if this, this year is gonna work out the way that I want it to. And what I really want is to be able to, you know, pursue my dreams soon after high school. And thankfully, I'm almost done with my book, so I can, you know, find a publisher now or start looking for publishers. Um, and then I have to, you know, probably start, you know, looking for scholarships and everything too, because, or applying for scholarships at least, because I need to start doing this stuff now. I can't fucking sit there and wait. And, you know, thankfully, I already took my senior pictures because I took them last week, so thankfully I already had all that shit done, and I don't have to worry about it unless I take pictures with another, you know, photographer, which I want to, but, I mean, I don't want to sit there and, like, work my parents to fucking, like, throw out a bunch of money, because I have to save my money, because I want to be able to, you know, get a new truck, I want to get a new truck, because mine is old, and it's also a hand-me-down, and I want my own, <laughs> and, you know, I've been, I'm trying to save up for, you know, also for college, or well, for, com for community college, if I have to go to community college, so, I'm trying not to use a lot of money, but, I mean, I don't know. It's, there's a lot of stuff going on this year, and I'm really excited, but I'm also nervous and anxious and afraid and scared and all these different emotions. So, <laughs> I think that's, you know, the end of my video. It, this is a short video. I mean, there's not really a lot that you can talk about, you know, about feelings towards something. I'm, of course, I can keep going on and on about the same motherfucking thing, but I'm not gonna sit there and put you guys through that, so I'm just going to kind of end this here. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I mean, for all you seniors out there that are watching my videos, I hope I nailed it on the bun, or I however you want to say it, say it, I hope I, you know, got the feelings, like, right, because I'm pretty sure we're also in the same thing, so, I guess it just kind of depends on the person, but that's how I'm feeling, but, um, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the video, you know, I hope you guys, you know, for those of you that are the younger, I hope you guys, you know, actually think about, you know, your future and what you want to do with your lives and what you want as a career. And just start thinking about it now because time goes by extremely fast. But, um, anyways. <laughs> I hope you guys liked the video. Um, stay tuned for more. I will, I will continue to do my videos every Sunday. And then I will continue to post poem videos, you know, every Tuesday and Thursday. So stay tuned for those two or check those out. So, yeah. I will see you all later. Could you be a movie star?